Happy Monday. It is May 18th and we've got a important and big week this week for first grade. We have just two weeks of school left and this week is our practice and final assessments. And you should have received the email from me yesterday so please go read that first if you haven't. So today we are starting with reading and they will be reading amazing jobs on willbooks.com. And actually on the lesson plans, I realized that I forgot to put in the comprehension questions that I usually do for after the book. So I will just be letting you know what those are over video each day. So the comprehension question is name a job you know. For language, they are doing the first page of the practice test that was attached to the email. And that is this page right here, page one. And on this page, uh, you're helping them read any words, any questions, you're even helping them to find the answers to be able to help them for Thursday and Friday. So what they're going to be doing is ABC order at the top, circling blends, short and long vowels, and nouns on this first day. And up here, I highly suggest drawing out the alphabet and showing them if they do A, B, C, D, E, F, G, the whole alphabet at the top of their page, that will help them to choose which one of these words should come first, what should come next. They can cross it out as they go. So showing them that strategy during the practice test will hopefully help them to be able to do that themselves on the final. And that goes for everything. So just reminding them of the strategies that they've been learning this school year and what they already know. For this, circling the blends, they're looking for any um, double letter, sorry, not double letter, but two letters that we blend together to make one sound. So they should know these pretty well, but S H D R D R B L B L A F L A CH P L A CH B R A so any of those kind of blends they're circling. For long and short vowels, for this page it's just the long or short A, so they're going to be in each problem circling the word that has the short A and underlining the word that has the long A, so either A or A sound. And then for nouns down here, just circling which of these words are a person, place, or thing. So that's day one for practice. And then for math, they're also doing page one practice of their practice test. And it's pretty straightforward. They do addition here, subtraction here, and then a mix of the two down here with these three numbers. The eight at the top is showing that that's the total and that six and two make up eight. And then they're going to be putting those numbers in either addition or subtraction sentences to go with it. So just these numbers for this. Um, and then for using whatever strategies they need to to come to their answers. So whether that's drawing pictures, using their fingers, counting up in their head, counting down in their head, whatever strategies they need to do. For subtraction, I suggest the counting up strategy for them. So keeping the three in their head and counting on their fingers till they get to seven and seeing that four is their answer, okay? For writing, they are doing typing on education.com. There's an assignment there for them for Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. So just doing the typing words assess assignment for Monday. And then for religion, it is in the lesson plans that I sent in the email right here. So they can uh, choose to answer all of these if they feel like it, or just one or two, whatever is up to you, either one or all, and uh, writing or video recording their answer and sending it to me. So the questions are, who were Jesus's parents on earth? Name a Salesian saint, and name the four books of the gospel in the Bible. And that is it for today. And as always, I am here to help. So please feel free to reach out and have a wonderful start to your week. Bye.